Here the question is: For the following piece of code, how many test cases are needed to get 100% statement coverage? And then these options are provided. Now let's analyze the code to get the correct answer. First line is: Read A, B, C. This is a statement, so we can represent it like this. Line two is: If A is greater than B, this is condition, so we can represent it like this. If this condition is true, line number three, print primary ratio is A divided by B, will be executed. Since it is a statement, we can represent it like this. Line number four is and if. This is a place where condition on line number two will end, and this is how we have to represent it in flowchart. Line number five is, if A is greater than C, since it is a condition, we can represent it like this on flowchart. Line number six is, print secondary ration is A divided by C. Since it is a statement, we can represent it like this. Last line is and if. This is a place where condition on line number five will end, and this is how we have to represent it in flowchart. With this, the flowchart is complete. Now let's solve the question. Here we have to find. Which of the following test cases would achieve 100% statement coverage? That means to find the answer, we have to analyze each of these options one by one. Let's start with option A. A equals five, B equals ten, and C equals two. Here, A is not greater than B. And A is greater than C, so this path of the code will execute. But with this, we miss one statement. That is why option A is not the answer. Let's analyze option B. A equals ten, B equals ten, and C equals ten. Here, A is not greater than B. And A is not greater than C too, so this path of the code will execute. With this, we miss both the statements. That is why option B is not the answer. Let's analyze option C. A equals ten, B equals five, and C equals two. Here, A is greater than B. And A is greater than C too, so this path of the code will execute. With this, we cover both the statements. That is why option C is the answer. For the provided question, option C is the answer.